Yo, yo, yo. Uh, I don't know, New Year, before New Year. Walking around, dragging in the cans. I think it was Thursday. And I go, oh no, you gotta be kidding me. See a screw hanging out of the sidewall. Wiggle it. Psh, leaking. Go, that's non repairable. Got the edge of the tire. That's what the screw was. Repairable is about an inch from here. An inch. This whole area, and then on the other side, about an inch. That's repairable area, steel belt. Non repairable. So, they make an appointment with the good old Costco. Costco tells them, like, Monday. Like, Monday? Okay. Monday for flyer? Yeah, Monday. Oh, okay. Right around the spare. Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday. Go there Monday. Yeah, we can't fix that. <laughs> Order a tire. Um, why did it take so long? Hurricane. Why? Hurricane. Hurricane? Yeah, there's crap over the road. The amount of flats we're getting is absurd. Everyone's coming in with shit in their tires. Because of the hurricane. The Bree truck comes. Put the stuff in the truck. Blows off. All, stuff all over the road. Hurricane screws, nails. Still, three months later. They don't sweep anything. They don't have sweepers. They don't have this blower, man. This makes it worse. They don't have any magnets. Nothing. And it rained. It rained the other day, too. So that's what kicked up a lot of stuff, I think. And it'll push it off to the sides. Like heavy, 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 heavy rain. But yeah, who would have ever known? I'm like blaming, like, what the hell's wrong with this company? Why are they being so stupid? Everything else. No. Hurricane. Who would have ever known? I thought. I feel stupid about that. But yeah. So when um tire shop tells you um, they're swamped, that's why. Everyone's running over crap. It's crap all over the road. And it really is crap all over the road. I've seen it, but I didn't put the two and two together. But how can I be so ignorant? But there you go, Hurricane, called FEMA. I think they had to pay a hundred and eighty six dollars it was prorated. The tire's like two forty now with the price of everything, that's insane. 15s or 186. That's messed up. Anyway, here's why my bicycle kept on getting flat tires too. I was probably running over stuff. But yeah, non repairable. It's non repairable. I like that shoulder over, probably repairable. Like halfway into that shoulder. I knew that looking at it. I marked it. Uh, how many freaking. But the good part is, only once they went out and the thing was probably deflated and they just didn't know that they wrecked the tire and they didn't wreck the wheel and they were like riding on a flat. So only once that happened. And then the other like 17 times we caught it beforehand. So that's a pretty good, um, pretty good thing for uh, flat tires and cars. Um, I, I have a theory on this but I don't even know. I'm not really going to share it, it's kind of sad, but, um, we actually had a family member die of a tire related failure, it was caused many, many, before my time, and, uh, I sometimes think they're sending you a freaking sign, because every time you see it, a thing, like, pops right out when I'm looking for it, it's weird, it's like, of all the places the tire could have landed, boom, but, could be, unrepairable.